I have a person that I did a walkthrough with her. She said she was ready. Then she kind of said, ah, give me a week. And so I want to just make sure that I know how to fill out this paperwork. Um, and so I've been asking a couple questions and one of them she has, so when we did the walkthrough, she has a room that has junk all in it. And she said she'd get all that out. And then the shed has stuff in it and there's a bunch of junk on the outside. She says she'll get rid of all that. And so I was wondering, Blair said, uh, I can't remember which paragraph it was, but there's somewhere that says something the seller will do. What's the best place to put that? And is there a correct way to word that or in the contract? I always word stuff as simply as possible. Uh, remember, the law in the United States is it, it is against the drafter of the contract. That's going to be you. So if there is ever confusion and you have to go to court, the judge will say, who wrote it? You say, it was me, your honor. He's like, okay, we rule against you because you wrote it. You should have made it really clear. It's not clear. It sounds like Greek. So what you do is make it really clear. You will clean this crap completely out of this closet and this shed. And okay. when I say clean, it's broom swept. It's, you know, okay. That kind of thing. Just real simple. Everything okay. will be removed, but keep in mind, if they don't want to get all that stuff out, you can buy really good deals with hoarder houses. Okay. I mean, a lot of people don't want to move their own junk out of there and you can get tremendous discounts to buy a house um subject to the junk that's in it taking it with that junk in it you can get a really big discount and it doesn't cost that amount of discount to get the thing clean if that makes any sense so okay in other words, you may get ten thousand bucks off and it may cost you a thousand to clean it okay so do those deals all day long she doesn't seem to really want to i don't know she's pretty stubborn about the price so mm -hmm. i don't know if that's the first place i want to go but um because she said she would clean mm -hmm. it out so maybe i should go with that for now i don't know well i'd, I'd go back and in, in, in dialogue with her and say if you'd like to leave everything in we can give you an offer that allows us to you know allows you to move just like it is and we'll go ahead and take care of everything and then give her an offer that's significantly less but okay. remember these people that are stubborn on price today these are people who two weeks ago thought they were going to get top of the market it's not happening it's okay. not going to be like that today. You now have the upper hand on this thing.